They're off. My cousin Matt off to an alert beginning on the far outside. Agadon also breaks well. Voodoo has come away third and is racing toward the leaders. Gaijastar out fourth. Posse is fifth in the early going. Then Papua followed by Peeping Tom, Highway Prospector, and Ghost Zapper is the last of them all. Ghost Zapper is 12 lengths from the leader, and the leader is Voodoo. Voodoo takes the field into the far turn. Opening quarter, eye-popping 21 and 4. Voodoo barreling along. The leader mile by two lengths. My cousin Matt is second, and Gaija Star is five lengths behind Voodoo. Right alongside him, it's Agadon. And Posse is six lengths from the front with two and a half furlongs remaining. Then farther back, Ahedris. Ghost Zapper was last on the back stretch and is now eight lengths from the leaders and continues to close on the far outside. The half in 44 and one fifth seconds. Closing in on Voodoo. Gaijastar will come up the inside. My cousin Matt fights on. Agadan right there on the outside. Posse's looking for a way through. Here comes Ghost Zapper from out of the pack, and he runs by them all. Ghost Zapper blows them away with an eye-opening performance. He won by six emphatic lengths here. Agadan finishing second. It was close for third between Posse. And they're off. Agadan breaks well, but there goes Unforgettable Max to the lead. Unforgettable Max to the front. Agadan second. Ghost Zapper away well is now third in line. Tamer up the back stretch. Unforgettable Max, the leader three quarters of a length. Agadan comes through on his inside and is looking for the lead now. Two and a half lengths ahead of Ghost Zapper, who's just ahead of Lion Tamer. Racing for the far turn. Unforgettable Max, the leader. They got a quarter there in 22 and two fifth seconds. Agadan trying to stay with Unforgettable Max. Lion Tamer makes a move. Ghost Zapper right there on the outside. Now they're really going at it. The four of them across the track, and here's Lion Tamer who comes on through. Splits horses to take a short lead. Ghost Zapper right with them with three furlongs to go. 44 and three, opening half mile. Coming to the top of the stretch. Lion Tamer, Unforgettable Max, Ghost Zapper, the three of them across the track. Agadan's behind them fourth, and they're off the turn into the stretch, and Ghost Zapper takes charge. Ghost Zapper in front. Javier Castellano shakes him up. He's responding and pulls away to lead by three. Agadan now drives up to be second as they come down to the final 16th. But Ghost Zapper does it with style here and gallops home to win by four emphatic links. Agadan second, Unforgettable and ready for the start. Got it. They're off in the Islin. Presidential affair broke very well. Ghost Zapper is right alongside and Private Lap sits off of them in third. And Zoffinger, not too surprising, well behind early. He's really dropping back already 12 lengths off the lead as they race by the stands. Presidential affair leads Ghost Zapper and Private Lap is sitting right behind him and he's a little bit rank in third as they go into the turn. They've got 15 on Zoffinger and they ran a quarter in 22 and four fifth seconds. Presidential affair is now by himself. He leads by a length and a half. Ghost Zapper content to sit second early and Private Lab content to sit third. And then it's Zoffinger and he's 20 lengths behind as they head down the back stretch. Presidential Affair and Stuart Elliott on top. The winner of the Salvatore Mile hit a half mile today in 45 and 4 fifth seconds. And Ghost Zapper is a length and a half behind in second. Castellano with a nice hold of him at this stage. Private lap starting to be pushed along by Joe Bravo. He wants more. And Zoffinger is well beaten. They're moving into the far turn. Presidential Affair continues to be tracked by Ghost Zapper. The lead is three quarters of a length. And they went three quarters in 109 and three. Presidential Affair now put to a drive. Ghost Zapper within a neck of the front runner as they round the far turn. They've left Private Lap behind, and Zoffinger's been last throughout. It's a two-horse race, Ghost Zapper and Presidential Affair, and Ghost Zapper has taken the lead at the top of the stretch, and he moves away by a length and a half. Presidential Affair is running his heart out in second. The rest of the field well behind. It is Ghost Zapper, and he's just far too classy. He goes by the 16th pole by himself and lengthens his lead to the wire. Ghost Zapper and Javier Castellano win the Island by eight lengths. Presidential Affair was second best, and it's going to be close for third. It looked like Zoffer. And they're off. 
and it was a good beginning for Ghost Zapper. Midway Road was away quickly as well. From the inside, St. Liam with his early speed, and on the far outside, Presidential Affair is fourth. They're out of the chute and onto the main track, St. Liam, to be the pacemaker, but lots of company there. Presidential Affair comes up on the far outside. Ghost Zapper right there in between horses and Midway Road as well. Two and a half flanks back. Newfoundland is running along in fifth. Bowman's Band sixth. And late running Seacold is the trader, about seven lengths from the leaders who have run an opening quarter in 23 and 3. St. Liam and the favorite Ghost Zapper is right there in good position while in between horses running second. Presidential Affair gets a nudge to keep up in third. Newfoundland is now fourth. Bowman's Band on the far outside. Midway Rose lost a couple spots now and is back to sixth on the inside and continues to lose ground into the far turn. And a long way back is about seven lengths back to seek gold. The half in 45 and three are on the far turn. And it's St. Liam and Ghost Sapper. And now they're going at it head to head as they're on the far turn. St. Liam running well off the rail. Ghost Sapper's out there second. Five lengths back. Bowman's Band is now third. Three quarters in 108 and three. A wicked pace here. And here comes Ghost Zapper well out in the middle of the track and he's got a narrow lead st liam is right there with them they're going at it head to head at the top of the stretch five lengths back to bowman's band and seat gold is fourth into the final furlong st liam is running a huge race today and appears to brush with ghost zapper in mid stretch a mile and 33 and one ghost zapper and st liam in a wild woodward they're coming down to the line and it's a photo finish that ghost zapper wins by a zap over St. Liam in a thrilling stretch duel. It was seven lengths back to Bowman's Band, and the final time was 146 and one in a thriller. And they're off. And Ghost Zapper comes away alertly on the inside. Free for Internet backs off him, and Azari takes the D inside. It's a big opening for Azari on the inside of Ghost Zapper, who's guided well off the rail. Roses and May is forwardly placed. Newfoundland is there on the outside. Bias for the first time now, and it's Roses and May, Ghost Zapper on the outside, Newfoundland, and Azari has been given the rail right up there with the boys. And then the Japan's personal rush is fifth and in between hearses. Perfect drift on the inside is sixth in the early going. Dine Ever four wide seventh and funny side is now back and in between horses running along an eighth. Birdstone down toward the inside. Then pleasantly perfect followed by Bowman's Band and Fantastic Cat a long way back to a lackadaisical, lackadaisical free for internet. 23 and 2 was the opening quarter there. It's Ghost Zapper in front. Roses and May prompting the pace on the outside. Azari up and down the pace. She's running third toward the inside after a half in a legitimate 47 seconds flat. Newfoundland right up on the pace as well. And then it's personal rushes in between horses racing fifth. Funny side being asked to pick it up early. He's now sixth on the outside. Asked for run. Four lengths from the front. Birdstone in and among horses. Die never in the clear in the far outside. Perfect drift. Rating comfortably six lengths from the front. Defending champion Pleasantly perfect is seventh and now called on for run as they round the far turn. Then Bowman's band fantastic hit. Midway round the far turn. Ghost Zapper now tackled in earnest by Roses and May. And they're letting out all stops coming to the top of the stretch. Pleasantly perfect. Cats up pulting past horses on the far outside as the field turns for home. Ghost Zapper has now shrugged off Roses and May. Pleasantly perfect continues to rally down the center of the track. Azari doing her best, but she's now fifth. In between horses, perfect drift. Ghost Zapper kicking clear, and Ghost Zapper is pulling away impressively. And a pumped up Javier Castellano. They have soundly defeated Roses and May. Pleasantly perfect was a well beaten third. Perfect drift was fourth. This was a no doubt about it winner. The final time was fantastic. One minute, 59 seconds flat. There are the disappointed boys from Sackets Harbor, a disappointed boy from Brooklyn as well, a disappointed guy from Artemis, Kentucky. But not so for Javier Castellano, Ghost Sapper, Bobby Frankel have won the Breeders' Cup Classic with Stud. 
Coast Sapper gets off to a good start. Love of Money and Forest Danger there on the far outside. But it's going to be Love of Money who's going to take the early lead. Forest Danger remains well off the rail in the early going. And Javier Castellano takes a good hold early of Ghost Zapper. He'll be third in the first few furlongs here. A break of four lengths back to Pomeroy, then Silver Wagon. Another four, five back to Sir Shackleton, the trailer. Up the back stretch run. 22 and two, a very solid first quarter here. Love of Bunny and Forest Danger on the outside. Forest Danger still remains well out into the middle of the track. Johnny Velasquez steals a peek back to check out Ghost Zapper, who's third on the inside. Into the far turn now. Love of money on an uncontested lead. A little difficult to handle is Forest Danger. There goes Ghost Zapper, making his move at the half-mile pole. And the half went in 44 and 2. And as they round the far turn, Ghost Zapper has taken charge. Ghost Zapper in front. Love of Money is second, and Forest Danger, perhaps something amiss with that one, very wide throughout. They're coming to the top of the stretch. Go Sapper, a two-and-a-half length lead. Forest Danger now on track, second. Love of Money is third. Five lengths back to Pomeroy and Silver Wagon, and they turn for home. Go Sapper has just run three quarters in 108 and two. Castellano's like a statue in the stirrups. Now just a nudge or two, and they're pulling away. They're pulling away to a five length lead. Silver Wagon runs in second. Pomeroy down toward the inside. Forest Danger, not himself today, and they're coming down to the finish. And here is the horse of the year, Ghost Zapper, to return to the races with style. He won by a half a dozen lengths over Silver Wagon. It was close for third there between Sir Shackleton and Pomeroy. The final time for Ghost Zapper was 133 and 1. Impressive once again.